Okay, so I'm going to show you how you actually navigate uh, through HEMA. So what you just saw there, I actually locked off my position so I can move the screen around. If I press this up arrow, I can't actually move the screen. Um, so just remember that when you're in HEMA maps. So I've locked off. Now, I'm just going to show you... There's a lot of misrepresentation about HEMA or a little bit confusion that it will navigate like a normal GPS. That's not true. You actually have to create your own route in order for you to be able to navigate off-road. So I'm just going to show you here quickly. I'm just going to use this as an example. Okay, I know it says MVO only. Please don't crucify me. I'm just using it as an example. So what I've done, I've created a waypoint at this particular position because I want to remind myself that I need to turn left here. And then I'm going to create another waypoint just here because I'm going to tell myself that I'm going to veer right because let's just say that where waypoint two is, that's going to be my destination. And then I'm just going to create one just off the highway so I know that I want to turn off at Woodford. So I can go back and edit these. Um, so, so we can see my little route there. So I'm going to go to the page menu. And I'm going to go waypoint navigation. So you can see down here, I'm going to bring up my waypoint list and I'm going to basically rename them. Um, this is where you can edit. So obviously waypoint three was the last one I put in, but I'm just going to name this one turn off. Woodford turn off. So I know this is where I want to turn. Okay, so I'm going to save that. So there's a whole bunch of stuff you can do in here. You can change colors, you can make sounds. Um, so waypoint zero was the bit where I wanted to turn left. So again, I'm going to edit that. And I'm just going to say, I'm just going to call it turn left, just, just as an example. Um, so here you can change colors, waypoints, and actually make a sound, uh, which probably would be a good idea when you want to turn. So I'm just going to say beep, yep, that'll do. Um, so that way I know if it goes off, I've gone past my destination and if I haven't turned. Waypoint one is going to be where I want to veer right because there was two tracks. So I'm just going to name it Veer Right. And again, I'm going to add a little bip. And then waypoint two is going to be the destination. Again, this is just a very simple example. I'm not going to worry about a bip because it looks like there's no, no more further to go, according to the map. Okay, so I'm going to go back. I have a look at my little waypoints. There we go. So this is basically how you navigate in HEMA maps. It's not like your regular GPS. It's not going to give you turn-by-turn -turn directions. You basically have to put a route in, and the way you do so is via waypoints. Um, so what I've just done here, I've just, just in case you get lost, um, you want to go back to where you are, you just lock on to your position again. So I'm going to go back into my waypoint navigation. I'm just going to show you that you can actually navigate. So let's say navigate to, and it basically draws a line so you know, okay, I've got 30. 32.4 k's um, for that waypoint. So you can see here, 42.7 k's to my first waypoint. Okay, I'm just going to drag the screen across just to show you. So it's actually pointing to my first waypoint. You can go back in, you can edit waypoints. 
um, as in you can change the, you can put in different coordinates if you want. So yeah, this is basically how you navigate in HEMA maps. So just know that when you opt for HEMA maps, you are opting for off-road maps. Bring up my list again. So I'm just going to delete a waypoint. So yeah, you can see it's quite easy. Delete waypoints. So I've got an edit. Here is where you can change your coordinates. So you could basically just put a waypoint anywhere and then put in whatever coordinates you want. Just going through and deleting them just to show you how to do it. Yeah, so that's that's pretty much how to navigate 